Hey y'all. Okay, we're coming back for baby girls five month update. Say hi mommy. Say hey mama. Hey mama. <laughs> She's not feeling it, y'all. She's not feeling well. Be okay, look. Okay. Her five month. Okay. Let me break it down, y'all. It's really her four month appointment. But when I called to make her four month appointment in November, she um they didn't have any appointments available except for the one for December twenty second. So that's the one we went to yesterday. Okay. So it's she's five months, but this appointment was really her four month appointment because she got her shots, her second round of shots. So, she's not supposed to get any more shots until she's six months and then when she's nine months. Okay. So, she's been, she, it's my fault though, y'all, but she's been, um, coughing and sneezing or whatever. So, um, I noticed she was doing that about a couple days ago. So, yesterday, she got her shots and that made it even worse. So, she's still coughing and sneezing, but now she's, um, hi, mommy. She's bringing out, um, snot and drool. She's teething all at the same time. So, it's a lot going on, y'all. But, yeah. Okay, so, she got her three shots, two in one thigh, one in another thigh. She got her, um... To live with my mouth okay and we had a few questions or whatever we had because she was um she was like spitting up so every time she ate she would well she would burp but she still you know spit up periodically throughout the day so all day she's spitting up so therefore about an ounce and a half of milk is coming out. So, therefore, we have to feed her more often because she's spitting out some of the milk. So, she's not staying full. So, we asked about that yesterday. And she told us to <clears throat> she told us to add the rice cereal. So, every one ounce you add a teaspoon of the rice cereal. So, that's what we're doing now. And I haven't noticed any spitting up since yesterday. Okay, and hold on, y'all. Okay, so, she's 10 pounds. Last time we went to her apartment, she was about two months. Now, she's five months. So, she's she was five pounds and something. Go check out my her last update video, and you can find out how much she weighed for the two-month appointment. And now she's 10 pounds. Okay, the reason she's 10 pounds now... And she's five months. I know that's slow gateway, but remember, she she was premature. So she's technically okay. Her she was born July six. Her due date is August twenty first. So because she came early, you have to count her age by her due date because she's early. So technically, she's three months, and she's supposed to be. 10 pounds at 3 months. But she's 5 months. So, the genetic... I, I forgot the word, the term that the doctor used. But she was saying, like, because she's premature, she's really 3 months. But her actual, you know, time being on Earth is 5 months. So, hi, Mommy. Say, hey, Mama. Um. Uh, see what I'm saying, you guys? She sneezes and snot comes out. Okay, we're gonna clean that. We're gonna clean that in a second, mama. You're okay. You're okay. Okay, so let me hurry up, you guys. I gotta clean her nose. Okay, and yeah, so she's technically three months, but she's five months. Okay. Now, what else did I tell y'all? Oh, yeah, we was giving her. Um, baby food out of the container. Hold on, hold on, you guys. 
Okay, y'all, she had to get in the video with mommy. Okay, so, yeah. I was giving her the food out of the container or whatever. So, the doctor said don't give her that because um, even though she eats it, it can destroy her, you know, her insides. So, I stopped giving that. Okay, she she's in the... She can't fit any newborn clothes anymore because remember last time she was able to fit the newborn. Now, she can't fit newborn. She's in... Zero to three months, even though she's five months, and we get her six to nine month clothes, and you know we put it on anyways, but it barely fits. She's a little mama. She's a little mama. Hi, mommy. So yeah, guys, I think that's all for this update. I will see you guys for the six month update, which would technically be technically that appointment would be just one time okay sorry for my hair you guys oh uh, it's so humid down here in georgia um i have natural hair so it kind of frizzed up in the mist so yeah i'm gonna flat iron that out sorry for no earrings i just had to do this video real quick before i wrap my hair so yeah say bye mommy say bye mama so yeah thanks for watching like subscribe and comment thank you guys for watching see you next time say bye oh my bad you guys okay some more things that she's doing she cools well it's past cooling now y'all she's talking she can talk to me she she grabbed let me see if I can show y'all this. You see how she grabbed my arm? Mm -hmm. You see that y'all? Yeah, she grabbed onto you and that means either she don't like something you're doing or she wants you to do what what she wants you to do. And she laughs, she rolls all the way over from her back to her stomach. She fusses. She's a little bit whinier now because she's teething and now she's not feeling well. She, uh, we read every night. We practice, um, you know, I get her the Dr. Seuss books because I think those are the most educational. And of course, I have to get her the Very Hungry Caterpillar and the Cow Jumped Over the Moon. And, you know, those little throwbacks. But, for now, we do Dr. Seuss. And, yeah. So, she does all those things. She, um... She wears... She can still fit a size one diaper. But, she wears twos. And... Um, I'm gonna give y'all... Give you guys, uh... One of her curly hair routines. I'm going to do a video like that because you guys see her hair? Can you guys see it? It's very curly and baby hair. See it? I don't know what, I don't know much to do with the baby hair. So, I just let those be. But, yeah, this is my little mom, my princess. Bless your mommy. I love her so much. But, yeah. Okay, and I guess I can give you guys a postpartum update for me also. I'm doing fine. I can feel my insides. So, yeah, I can feel everything move through with them. I can feel everything, everything. I can feel burps, hiccups, bowel movements, urine. I can feel my bladder. I can feel my stomach. I can feel my spleen, my pancreas, my rib. Well, not here for my rib. Everything in the stomach, I can feel and um yeah so um, that's all for y'all that's all from us see you guys later bye